Ooh, what's that sound? What's that sound? I think it's angel wings. Can you hear them? Ooh, flutter, flutter, flutter. Flutter, flutter, flutter. Anyway, have a look at what I've got here. I've got this gorgeous kind of lace effect. Obviously, you've got to print this off onto whatever paper you want. You've got these beautiful angels. Now, you've got them in different sizes, but they've got that lovely gold effect. Let me just run through some of the designs that you can be printing off. Now, I've got the large one here. Now, this is part of the card that I'm going to be making. And you can see how beautiful that is. I mean, get in close in that if you can. And have a look at the detail in that, the quality of the detail. You've got this beautiful angel. Now, I stuck it onto some silver card because I'm going to make it like a stand-up card using it. But you're going to get them all in different sizes as well. So that's the large size. And you also get the step-by-steps to make different sizes. Then you've got this one here. That's the next size down. And you've got various options as well. So you don't have to print them all off at once. You just print them as you need them. Therefore, you're saving your ink. So therefore, you're saving all the space in your craft room. You've not got thousands and thousands of papers. Just print them as you need them. Excuse me. <coughs> I've got a little angel in my throat. I'm like a little devil on my shoulder, knowing me. Now, there's one. That one there does the whole 3D angel that I'm going to show you how to make, but in the small size. And you've got the first one here. You've got the second one. Third one, fourth one, fifth one, sixth one. You see, it's all on one page. And we don't put on anything. We're trying to save your ink as well. We only put on there that's necessary. We don't put any colours on there. So when this prints out, it's just going to print out what you're going to cut out. Therefore, it's saving your ink and everything. If you want a larger version, if you want, say, maybe three or four, then you can get them multiple per page. And then you're saving yourself your paper as well. In this case, we've got, if you want to make four of those, you would print those out. And then you'd print that one out and then you've got the full uh, set there to make four angels you could have four angels you can do back and front as well you could make lovely christmas tree decorations you can make them on cards use them on your scrapbooking these would be gorgeous can you imagine those printed onto acetate and then stuck onto a glass a glass bowl and you put a candle inside Fabulous. Then you can do some mini ones. Now these would be really good for making tags as well for Christmas, little angel tags. You could theme your whole Christmas golden angel. So you could decorate your tree, you can make your cards, you can decorate your presents, you can use them as tags. Lots of different ways you can use these. And don't forget, while you're on, on the website, go and have a look at all the different categories because lots of these designs mix and match and work together. Okay, now I'm going to make a card using the large one. And as normally, I've cut out all the boring bits, so you don't have to sit there and say, eh, hey, F, all look at him, cutting that thing out again. We should get on with it. Well, I'm going to get on with it. I know my public. I know what you want. You want to just see the finished article. So there you go. There is the start of that. All I've done is printed the large one out, cut it out. I stuck it onto a piece of lovely silver card, and then I've just uh, cut around it. When I cut around it, though, I've just left a border all the way around that really kind of... Oh, look at that, all sparkling. I think angels should shine, don't you? Now, next section. I've put some double-sided foam pads on the back, and that's going to layer up the top. This will make a fantastic, not only a card, but a Christmas decoration standing on your windowsill or on the fireplace. Don't forget it is paper, though. <coughs> if it's next to a real fire, just think about safety all the time. Don't leave lighted candles in your home, etc., etc. So just be careful when, where you put certain things. You see how that's layering up now, giving a lovely gold 3D effect? Then I'm putting the next layer on, which is there. That goes on there like that. And then the next layer. Now you could have this as an opening card. You can do what you want. But I thought this would be quite nice as a 3D kind of ornament a tree, not tree, angel type effect. You can see how you get that lovely 3D look. Uh, I'm going to put the last bit on there and that sticks there down like that. I mean, wouldn't that be fantastic? Hanging on a front door, stuck onto a wall, but I'm going to have it so it stands. Now, what I've done, I've cut out a little piece of, just a corner of an A4 piece of card. I've cut the top off and I've also, this, I don't know if you can see, but this actually was straight along there. I've cut out a little diagonal kind of cut across there at the bottom so it's not quite flat it tilts backwards so this is not going to tilt forward and fall over it will tilt backwards and it will stop it falling over so all you've got to do then is on the back of here i'll put some double-sided tape just line that up in the middle and just stick that down like so that then will fold over so that when you want to stand your card ta -da, if it falls over i'm going i'm going to the bottom of our stairs there you go. There is your card. There's your beautiful angel card that you can make. It's also a Christmas decoration. Isn't that beautiful? 
Now you can make those as many as you like because you've now got the download. You can download the small, the large, the medium. You can mix and match. Not only can you make a beautiful card like that or an ornament, whatever you want it to be. You can have a chain of angels. You can decorate up, you can theme it. But there are loads and loads of other beautiful uh, Christmas uh, downloads that would go really well with this. So if you want to make a beautiful angel, let me put it in position so it looks really, oh no, I'll leave it there. I'll leave it there. There you go, it'll do there. But what I don't like about that picture, so we'll take a proper picture in a minute, is my tummy. I don't want to close up for my tummy, so just download it and make them any time you like. 